Hello, welcome to Jetline Marvel, we'll compare two lethal fighter jets in this video. The J-10 was built by China, and the Tejas Mark 1A was built by India. In terms of war zone capability, both aircraft are superior. What we are waiting for, let's get started. The J-10 is a small multi-role fighter, with a single engine that can fly in all weather conditions. It was built to carry out strike and air-to-air -air combat operations for the People's Liberation Army Air Force, China. The LCA Tejas MK-1A is a 4.5 generation multi-role light fighter developed by India. It is ideally a single-seat fighter jet, but also can be manufactured into a twin-seat fighter jet. Relaxed static stability, a fly-by-wire flight control system, multi-mode radar, an integrated digital avionics system, and a flat-rated engine are among the features. The J-10 is 52 feet 7 inch long, while the Tejas is 43 feet 4 inch. J-10's wing size is 360 square feet, while the Tejas has 413 square feet. The empty weight of the J-10 is roughly 9,750 kilograms, whereas the Tejas has a weight of 6,560 kilograms. The maximum takeoff weight of the J-10 is roughly 19,277 kilograms, whereas the Tejas is 13,500 kilograms. Astra MK-1 is also integrated on Tejas MK-1A, giving an edge to the fighter over its contemporaries in BVR warfare. With the introduction of Pod Self-Protection Jammer and AESA on Tejas MK-1A, the survivability of the aircraft is further enhanced. Tejas is famous for its pure delta wing configuration, with no tail planes or four planes and a single dorsal fin. The J-10 has an internal fuel capacity of 3,860 kg and an external fuel capacity of 3,120 kg, whereas the Tejas has an internal fuel capacity of 2,458 kg and an external fuel capacity of up to 2,201 kg. The J-10 is powered by a Chinese-developed engine, which replaces the Russian AL-31 engine that was used in prior models. For long-range interception, it uses the PL-15, a dual-stage BVR AAM with a range of 200 km or more. The Shenyang WS-10 engine, which was developed in-house, can produce up to 140 kN of thrust, whereas the Tejas is powered by single General Electric F400 and for afterburning turbofan, produces 85 kN thrust with afterburner. The J-10 has a top speed of 2,305 km per hour that is Mach 2.1, while the Tejas has a top speed of 2,220 km per hour. Tejas has an electronic warfare suite domestically developed which consists of a radar warning receiver, integrated self-protection jammer, chaff, and flare dispenser system, and beyond visual range missile capabilities. Tejas equipped with iDerby ER, an extended range version of the Derby that increases range to 62 miles, and also Python 5, which has range up to 20 kilometers. The J-10 has a combat range of 900 km, whereas the Tejas has a range of 500 km. The J-10 has a ferry range of 3,200 km, whereas the Tejas has a ferry range of 3,200 km. The J-10 has a service ceiling of 56,000 feet, while the Tejas has a service ceiling of 52,500 feet.
It features 11 hard points that is 6 under the wing, 2 under the intake, and 3 under the fuselage. And 1 Bryazev Shaipanov GSH-23 gun. With a capacity of 5,600 kg of external fuel, it is equipped with 90 mm unguided rocket pods. It carries the PL-8, 10, 12, 15 air-to-air -air missiles, as well as the KD-88 and YJ-91 air-to-surface missiles. It can carry laser-guided, glide-guided, satellite-guided, and unguided bombs weighing 250 kg and 500 kg. Tejas has quadruplex digital fly-by-wire flight control system with associated advanced flight control laws. Extensive use of advanced composites in the airframe gives a high strength to weight ratio, long fatigue life, and low radar signatures. Tejas has 23mm twin-barrel GSH cannon, and it has 8 hard points one is in port side intake trunk and 6 under wings, and one is in fuselage. It can carry 5,300 kilograms of payload. It has S-8 rocket pod. It can carry various missiles like R-73, I-Derby, Python, SRAM, and Astra Mark I and R-77. It has KH-59 Me, L and T, AASM Hammer and Brahmos NGALCM. It has Redram, 1 anti-radiation missiles as well as KH-35 and 59 MK anti-ship missiles. SPICE, HSLD, DRDO glide bombs, laser-guided bombs, cluster munitions, and unguided bombs are some of the precision-guided munitions it may carry. The J-10 is estimated to cost roughly $35 million, whereas the Tejas Mark 1A is estimated to cost around $41 million. In the comments box, please tell us what you think about J-10 and the Tejas fighter jet. If you liked our video please subscribe to our channel.